Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So I'm so sorry that I couldn't upload my video on last Sunday and I missed the consistency just because I had a wedding in my family from the last few weeks. So I was busy in that. And finally I got a way to make my video and still I have guests in my house but I will try that there is no disturbance in this video. So let's begin. As you can, as you have read the title of my neat journey experience. So let me share you for how I it went and how much it may bring out the result. So I remember that in 11th and 12th, I sincerely prepared for my academic sessions and was not preparing for need. Although I knew that I had to go in that medical session, but still I just choose to prepare for 11th and 12th from my hometown. And so it did. I did. I scored good marks in my 11th and 12th. And for my need, I had to take one year drop. And uh, my admission was in Akash Institute of Delhi. So <coughs> it was all fine. I just end up my boards exam on 14th March and just from 16th I went to my sister's place and after that I came on 19th and we went back all these stuff at our house to go to Delhi and everything was packed and just we were about to leave it was on 26th March and as we were going through the day coming next and next we just heard about our respected and honorable coronavirus which is really hectic and i know that those years had gone on trauma but uh, we just heard on 20 march and then we were like we were shocked for how i i will attend my classes so it was all new then we got to know about uh, our uh, online classes and how to control zoom was really out of my mind because i am not such a technology person who just get themselves advanced by using some apps and get in one especially these online classes are really tough from for that time actually i know now but it was all new facing your teachers your classmates who are from different states coming and studying at that Akash Institute of Delhi. So just my class began on 20 April. Now coming up to the important content like how I began my journey and how how, how it went. So let me tell you. Like um, it was the first day I had a good experience and meanwhile my, my phone was dead because charge was zero person. So I went um, like um, the next day I prepared for the power bank then I found that my internet is not working so I had to put on the Wi-Fi and then sometimes um, like Wi-Fi um, sometimes connect disconnect or due to the weather conditions also it creates problems so I had to face that also and meanwhile I just left my lectures too. So for that uh, missing lectures, I used to join the doubt class which was from 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. So it was like good and then in the beginning like how you have to stay in the home and to study whole day not going out was really difficult. Even our teachers said that they know that it's not easy for anyone to stay whole day at home studying, preparing for me. But uh, our teachers were very cooperative uh, that Akash has provided us with the timetable and we used to follow that very well and whenever we had problem we used to talk to our teachers for how to manage with the timetable. They used to say that if you are not capable or if you are not able to follow with that timetable just make your own. So I tried, I tried to make timetable, I just tried to keep I just tried to stick on that timetable but um, somewhere I lagged I know somewhere I lagged I used to wake up at 8 a.m. daily just took one hour to get fresh up um, to get into some 
uh, exercises and then at 9 pm exactly i used to get myself steady for whatever i read last night i used to revise it and whatever it's going uh, our teachers are going to teach us i used to revise it as well from the module and the problem with me was like wherever um, where my location is my module used to come here very slow like um, i just um, we had started our uh, first module it was on time but for the second module like when we have when all the class had finished their second module then my second module was arriving at my place so that was quite difficult for me to balance the, to solve those questions like um, together module 2 and module 3 so i had to totally devote myself to ncert and from where will i get questions so my teacher suggested me like my local teacher suggested me to practice from mtg so i i just used um, i just heard more from other students as well about mtg i bought it and it really helped me a lot like i would also suggest to the people who are preparing from their home to buy an mtg and to practice from it because from mtg you will get line to line questions from it in the form of mcqs and you had mtgs and like with mtg i used to practice from previous year questions which helped me a lot in this exam so like this problem was solved about that module shift and then later on what was the my problem like my class goes from 10:30 to 2:30 pm so 10:30 to 11:30 it was fun shift and then from 11:30 to 11:40 it was break and from 11:40 to 2:30 i had my second class and i had a habit of sleeping and i really had a regret of sleeping during the evening time so people if you have a habit of sleeping in the noon time or in the evening time please just stop sleeping in the evening time and it's better if you sleep once in a day like if you choose like i was a night person i used to study whole night like um, i used to study till 3 am and then sleep and wake up at 8 so it was um, all new for me for um, to study about new things like my academic session was not so deep to know about the stuffs i had to study like uh, how much i can understand and the second thing i would say like uh, if i had doubt in any concept i used to clear with my respected teachers and if i had any concepts that i was not clear about there is a bad habit of me like uh, if i have any doubt and or if i couldn't solve any questions then i used to take tension and that my whole day goes in vain so people i'm suggesting you if you have a doubt if you couldn't solve a question leave it for a while ask your friends and even if they can't help you then ask your respected teachers it's really not embarrassing to clear your doubts in the class if everyone could solve don't compare yourself with them you are different they are different they might be weak in some topic in which you are already strong so just believe in yourself that you are strong enough you are well enough to understand yourself for where you can lack where you are good at so just keep going and i at the end i would like to suggest that keep solving your mtgs your modules your pyq questions and pyq would be better if you solve in the last months and some problem was also that i faced was in the month of january our syllabus was going in a rush like nobody knows that when our exam will be held no date was decided people were saying that it will go on march april may june and finally it happened on september 12 so just don't hear the news it will totally distract you disturb your mind just keep going with the thing that you know that you can and just keep revising and if you even score low in the mock test find the error and work on it 
Don't feel yourself embarrassed if you have doubts in any content of your syllabus. It's okay if you keep on asking again and again. It's okay if your teacher get gets angry on you. It's okay if they scold you for why you are asking this topic again. If everybody knows in the class, it's okay if they say that you should know but still you don't know. Everything is okay because no one is going to ask you for you know or if you know. What matters here is your neat result. And I'm telling you people seriously that this paper is really not tough until and unless you make it it's all in the mind if you think it's hard then it is hard and if you think it's easy then definitely it all demands for is hard work and smart work how you balance it if you can't make timetable it's okay you have your own capacity you know yourself better than others than your respected teachers so just do it the best way you find it you can and the last thing i will say that uh, at some time you will have your self doubt for you will not be able to achieve what you wish for just find yourself at some place where no one is there to disturb you and then ask yourself that how will you look in that white coat and that honor you will get and the name of doctor you will get in before your name and the respect your family your parents your friends will give you and they will get from others after introducing you as a doctor so stop worrying if you want to go if you want to take fresh air just go and just get your own way for how you can study well because more than others you know yourself better so this is all for my neat aspirants that prepare yourself very well i shared you my experience and let, let me tell you that failure is the pillar of success my neat score was not so good so obviously i'm not going to share it here but i will say you that it was all if you have any questions about the experience or doubts of which books to prefer i would sincerely say you to prefer ncert first priority and then you can take your modules of akash allen wherever you prefer whatever you prefer better and then mtgs and then at last months pyqs questions and people just find yourself comfort comfortable don't mess that i will solve akash and l module both i will solve um i will solve mtgs and pyqs all together no at the last time what you can do is what you have solved is done what you need to keep going is with the PYQ questions. How much you practice, it will be more better. And um, for bi- biology, just complete the books as much as you can. Try to complete. It. For uh, for f- physics, you just need to revise book for once, like in the last month. And for chemistry, I would suggest to read the books. If uh, and there are stuffs that you don't need to focus. So just ask your teachers; they will prefer you the best way. Ask your classmates. And and for clearing my doubts, uh, my best friend helped me a lot in this. I'm really, really thankful to her. So now it's uh, I'm coming to end. This is all for the experience of my new journey. We'll see you soon next week. Bye bye take care